Ah, uh, here we go again. All right. So we're going right in. We should. I should go and eat. But I'm not gonna, cause I don't care. All systems online. Fred sucks. He's the bane of my existence. Fred. Fred. Your resilience should demand respect, but it only makes me want to kill him even more. That's the problem. Like, I just want to sit here and keep... It's like, I feel like I'm bashing my head against the wall with this. Um, I don't know if it's even possible, but I want to find out. Look at the games. Like, not... not The game's, like, not happy with me right now for some reason. It's bugging out like crazy. All right, so we got to go deep. We need one more gel sack so then we can get a second torpedo bay. And then we're going to start just... Man, we're going to go ham on this. I think what we'll get rid of is... Probably the depth module. We'll pull that out. I know it's possible, and I know that we don't get anything. You just get the you get the satisfaction of the kill, man. That's what I want. I want my revenge. He's destroyed three of my sea moths. I want my revenge. That's what I want. I want what is mine. I want what is owed to me. I want it. Can we use some salvage? Don't crash into the ground, please. Alright. I never expected Fred to bring his girlfriend along. What a cheater. Can't even face me in a fair fight. Has to bring a friend. He was supposed to 1v1 me. Alright, this is supposed to be just a, just a regular 1v1. But here he is, cheating. Should have expected it. Should have expected it from him, of all people. I'm like trying to go down, but I keep pressing the button to make me go up. <laughs> it's pretty stupid. Um, okay. What have we here? Uh huh. Uranium. I lose health, health from picking that up. Alright. So we're down a little deep. We're down about 400 meters. Ugh. God, the creepy spiders are all around us. We're looking for gel sacks. Uh, that's all we're looking Oh, God! Dang it. Stop going up. Stupid spiders. Okay, now you need to go up. Keep pressing the wrong button. I, let me tell you, man, I have tried stabbing him. I have stabbed the ever-living life out of him. We had him pinned in a corner one time, and I just stood there. I have I have it in the playlist. Um, we stood. We had him pinned in a corner, and I just stabbed at him for probably like five minutes straight. And it just, it nothing. It just didn't even phase him. All right, we've got two gel sacks. That's more than we need. Let's get out of here. Go back to Mother Base. Before our other enemy comes up. Yeah, it's like uh, something happened and he kind of... I think he glitched a little bit, but... He got he got pinned against a wall. And he couldn't... For some reason, it wouldn't let him move. And we were just sitting there just slicing. And it was just endless. And he just still would not die. And it makes me wonder to a degree. Like, I, I I know he's killable, but there's a part of me that wonders if he's killable on survival mode. Or if you have to kill him, like, on a different mode or something. Which, that's going to be very disappointing if that's the case. But I don't think that's the case. I think he's killable. He just has a lot of health. Woo! Woo! Alright. I'm going to try again. We're going to fill up both of our torpedo bays. I don't think we're going to use the gravity torpedoes at all anymore. I don't I don't think they're very useful. We're going to fill up our tor torpedo bay with lots of poison torpedoes. And we're going to just, just fill them full. Hopefully this time we don't find two Freds at once. Hopefully it doesn't bring his girlfriend again. But it could happen. And hopefully we don't miss 
um, all of our shots. I don't know why it keeps like going through his body and not hitting him. That's probably the most frustrating thing. Whew. Belly of the beef beast. Sometimes we're the Rex. Oh man. That's fine. I just want to see him float right down to the ground. Once I see it, he can come back. Now that I know there's more than one, he can come back. I don't care. Alright, down we go. If he comes back, I don't... Whatever. Once we know... If, once we know he can bleed, it can kill it. If, we, if, if, we, if it can bleed, we can kill it. There you go. I need a ruby. First, we need to put away some of this gel sack that we can eat. So I have to be careful that I don't accidentally eat it. Eat it, eat it. Alright, I need lithium. Okay. Pro gel. Titanium. Give me that. I'm gonna have to go get more. Uh, so angry. I didn't expect this to take so much effort. Want to know another torpedo bay? The whip gets more dangerous by the minute. All right, we don't need to go down super deep to fight him. Hmm. Uh huh. <laughs> I didn't expect that one. That's that's pretty good. That's pretty good. That got me. I don't want four on one side. Thank you very much. <sighs> He's a goofy game, I swear. There we go. That's what I want. We need the shock. We need defense. Okay. <laughs> okay. Take it easy, Marquine. Good luck. <laughs> All right. So here we are. Let's see what we can do. Um, so we need to make missiles. So let's put our um Let's put that uranium away. Okay. We should probably put the depth module away just in case. Let's see. What else do we need? So we need titanium and we need gastropods. Didn't we have a bunch of those? We do have a few. Oops. Let's fill our food up as well. Good. Get ourselves full up and then we'll go. Uh, that's kind of unfortunate. It's alright, we'll regrow both of those trees. I want him to die and I want to do a little work on the Cyclops, man. But this is my goal today. He needs to die. I need I need one of those Freds at least to faint. Come here, boy. Hey, boy. Hey, hey, boy. Hey. Go on. Shoot off all those gas pods. Thank you. Ooh, got most of them. Ooh, I think I got them all, actually, that time. Right, we're going to go over to this guy. Right in the face. Oh, definitely need to get away. Yeah, but dabba. 
Release all your pods in one area, please. Oh, you did. Thank you. Whoa! Getting a little closer, okay? Oh, we missed all of them. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's just fill up on these. I missed that one. Oh, we're still in it. How are we still in it? Come on. Alright, move away. Where are we at? We need four more. We're gonna fill up. Like, we're just gonna get all of them. Alright, get out of the poison. Ah, get out of the poison. Dang, there's like a ton of salvage over here, too. Oh, my lord. Alright, so we've got enough of these. We'll put them away, and we'll go get a ton of titanium. I swear, we're just going in circles. I just... Hmm. This is going to be our last attempt. We've upgraded our ship to its, like, highest capacity when it comes down to this. This is our last attempt on uh, aboard, killing Fred. Better work. Better work. We're gonna use the copper one because that's where I have the most room. Some like fiber. Right, and then a little bit of food. Nice. Okay, so we need some titanium. Let's go back to where we were. There's a ton of scrap around here. Scrap. Scrap. Alright, gastropods. I'm not worried about you right now, alright? You gassy mother truckers. I ain't got no worries about you. It's gonna be our last battle, guys. The final confrontation. Hey. Why don't you drop that? Ow, that kinda hurt. Ow, would you give me that already? You guys suck. found like three yeah there's always Williams always in there so or at least nearby come on now just give me some salvage Surface salvage not looking good, so let's go down low. I might be able to find some down here. Yeah, yeah, yeah I hear you. Ah, uh -huh, look at this. Nice. I think we're full now. Check. Oh, we can get two more. Two more salvage. Alright, there should be some around here. I had a feeling. Don't worry, Fred. I'll come back for you. 
But now, this is what I need. Wow, that was a big pile of salvage right there. 290 away. Alright, he's very close. Fred is very, very close to my base. It's making me very uncomfortable. But, at least we should be able to get him. Stalkers are building up their forces as well. I wish if I got near them that they would start attacking Fred. I can't believe how much of a struggle we've had just to try and get this guy. At, after this point, truly, if, if we try this time, I'm, I'm convinced it doesn't work, that there's, like, it's just not going to happen. Like, it's, we've unloaded so many missiles into this guy, I just don't know. I don't understand. I would think, like, maybe 10, 20 missiles or so would be it for him. So we want half of what we have. Like this, and we'll count them up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. That's all we're going to use, guys. We're going to have about 30 rounds, it looks like, roughly. Oops, that's not what I meant to do. It's all right. <sighs> would you not? Dude, would you just not, please? I'm alive. Dingus. Alright, let's make some torpedoes. Let's get our missiles all set, boys and girls. I'm gonna go back, I'm gonna load both torpedo bays, and then I'm gonna go back. And, uh, get the rest. I wanna be completely full up. Right when it comes back up, we're hitting it. I can't believe that this has taken so much effort just to kill one of these guys. And there's ones that are like bigger than Fred. That's the that's the crazy thing. I won't even I don't even think we can kill any of them, man. Good, we can load them all up at once. Okay, so how many more can I make? Uh, one, one, two, three, four, five. So five titanium and five gas pods. Do I, need, do I have any left over? Did I mess up my numbers? I didn't, I got it perfect. All right, five gas pods. One, two, three, four, five. Five titanium. This is the best I can do right now. Truly, there is no better than I can, that I can do at this moment than what I'm trying to do right now. Like, I am giving it like 110%. <laughs> this is nuts. Ten more of these guys. At least I can load them both at the same time. I think when I shoot now, it'll shoot both off. 
I think it doesn't like make you try and load up both or whatever. All right, we're a little hungry. We can go grab a food block or something. Yeah, I don't want to risk it. I don't want to risk that coming back to haunt me, you know? All right. Time has come. Ah oh, man. You can only shoot one at a time. That's a that's a bummer. But at least we don't have to stop for as long. Here we go, guys. The final confrontation. We need this. I need this. Maybe that was a stalker. That was Big Boy Fred himself. I think it was a stalker. We can only go 200, so we can't go very deep. I need to remember this, because he will grab us and like try and tear us down. Hear the noises. Probably should have shock ready. He's going to come out of nowhere. Alright, Freddy boy. Where you at? Last I saw him, he was in gastropod territory. Freddy, Freddy, Freddy. Hmm. Fred, you son of a gun, you son of a biscuit, where are you? Show yourself, you idiot. Where are you, Fred? The games have been played and they are done. I am as prepared right now as I could be. lower. I don't think I'm going in the general area that he normally is, so I think I need to go this way. Basic sharks. Interesting. Well, we're just finding sharks now. So I don't think I'm going in the right area because normally Fred isn't around sharks. Just an observation I've had. That is land, that is not Fred. I think we're down too far. That's another thing with Fred, is he's normally pretty close to the top. He doesn't tend to go down super low. Hmm. That shark is up pretty high. They don't norm those guys don't normally come up very high. Where am I heading towards? Bondi Beach? I think we need to circle back a little bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You aren't my target, you stupid stalker. You guys suck. I'm pretty sure I could kill a stalker with, like, cut, like, four torpedoes. But not the one we're at today. Not today. Familiar noise. Where are you? Aha, uh -huh. there you are. 
I see you now. Come forth, Fred. He's about to spawn in. He's going to be right in front of me. There he is. Ah, I got myself in it. Come on now, let me go. I hate the gravity ones. Not a fan of the gravity torpedoes, that's for sure. Where did he go? He was just right over here, I think. Is that him? You stupid torpedo, you made me lose Fred. Oh, God! Base of maneuvers. Shock him. Shoot. Hit him. Got a weird thing going on here, Fred. Got him right in the face. All right, he's on the run. Come on, get in. Well. This is not... Um, oh, I really expected this to go. A little weird. Right in Fred's face. He's. I guess he's stuck again. Well, this will answer our question now, won't it? We did it. We did it. We killed him. We killed Fred. He's he's dead. We actually killed him. Oh my god. We got revenge. Revenge has been
That's like the best picture right there. Yes! Oh my god! I'm so happy. I can't even begin to tell you guys. Yes! We killed him! We killed. If it can bleed, we can kill it. We killed it! Yes! 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 Ah! You are dead, Fred. May you live out your days in hell, you beast. This is for all the ships of mine that you broke. You are dead. I hate you, and I hope you never come back. One day. What's the deal with this guy? Are you going after my ship? You get out of here, dude, or I'll kill you too. We killed Fred. We did it. Would you stop popping up like an idiot? I want a good picture of this. That's like, I want like 50 of those pictures in my PDA. Oh, the day, the day we killed Fred. I'm speechless. I, I actually was starting to believe that we weren't going to be able to kill him. Like, I had become convinced that it just wasn't going to happen. Now, granted, we did kind of end up getting a little bit of a, a cheesed kill. But it's a kill nonetheless. And it's proof that he is killable. Like Marquine said, you don't really get anything for it except for the sense of accomplishment for taking down such a giant beast. Oh, Fred, I remember on day one, I remember the first time you grabbed me. Scared the living bejeebus out of me. I remember our knife fight. I remember the time when you blew up my ship because I left it up, I left it up top. Speaking of ship, i going to check on it. And then now look at you. Remember when I first got the ability to shock? And then that's when I lost the fear of you. Look at my shadow in Fred. <gasps> Am I the true beast? All is calm. We did it. It took a lot of effort. It took a lot of torpedoes. But we did it. Fred is dead. And now we must prepare for the next great threat that will rise. Fred's girlfriend. Girlfriend. Fred 2. The threatening. Fred 2. Fred Boogaloo. I keep waiting to see if he's gonna, like, come back to life. Or if he's just going to sit here. I want to see it if it happens. So we'll give it like another couple seconds. I just, I'm still just blown away. Like, I, oh man, I was so convinced that we were just going to have to give up on it. But we don't. Because we won. Perseverance, boys and girls. That's what it takes. One last picture. Pew. All right. There may be other Freds in the future. Other Freds who pose great threats just like this one. But we will kill them just like we killed this one. Like they said, he could come back. But we know we can kill him. So his threat is no more. He is no longer the great threatening beast that he once was to me. 
Now he's just good old dead Fred. Good old dead Fred. All right. Okay, I hear you. You know what? You better, you better hope I don't have any torpedoes. Yeah, you like that, huh? Better run. I'm the beast of the sea now. Who's the killer now, huh? Yeah, how do you like that? How do you like them apples? Huh? But is he sinking now? I think he's sinking. Oh, he's gone. His body's gone now. It despawned. It sank to the bottom of the ocean. Where it belongs. In the depths. Where his accursed, accursed self belongs. Below the sand. I'm feeling pretty good right now, guys. Yeah. Yeah. I'm feeling pretty good right now. No lie. No joke. That was great. That was a big moment for me. Look how close he was to our home. It was only like seconds away. He was truly a menace. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you. Beautiful. Well, now that we've done this, we need to put the depth module back in. I think we're going to let the energy thing stay out, and we'll keep a torpedo launcher in case we get attacked in the future. And we'll keep, like, some torpedoes on us for the for that. Because we can get things to at least get away from us um, if that happens. So, we're going to unhook one of these. We're going to actually... I need to jump back in this. Because... I'm going to do this. Alright, that's good. Fantastic. Just... Oh, I'm super happy. There's like, words can't even describe it. I'm just... I'm on cloud nine right now. That's the best way to put it. Just, I am on cloud nine. Problem I have, though, is now I have a ton of torpedoes, and I don't have anywhere to put them. So we're going to stock them here for now. Because we can fill them with lead. Get it? <laughs> That's good. Uh, man. Oh, my God. I'm just so happy. So, Seamoth 3. This can go in the prawn, um, but we're going to take Cyclops. Cyclops Depth 1. Takes a lot to increase the cyclop and to increase their depth. Alright, laser cutter. This, this. Always keep a beacon on you. Batteries. Good, 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 good. And we'll keep one of these guys with us for now on. Alright, so we want to do some upgrades to the cyclops. That's what we're looking at now. I'm not really quite sure what upgrades I want to do. So good. I'm so happy. Ah, uh, yes. What a day for achievements. Huh? We have the Cyclops. We have our new mobile base. All systems online. We have Alfred holding down the fort. Let's go hit the lights because we got work to do. And I can't see anything, so. Turn this on, please. Bingo. What is this? External floodlight. Nah, we don't need that. Alright. So, where do we put in things? Thingamajigs. Where do we put the upgrades for the Cyclops? I think it's in the engine room. Alright. So, we got Cyclops Upgrade Fabricator. And I think the upgrades are on the other side. Start working on bumping this guy up. Alright, so what we have for you, 
sir is the engine efficiency bingo and we have a depth module wow with just one it goes up to 900 holy crap this thing can go really far down oh nice so we've got the prawn down there can I, can I plug in upgrades from up here I didn't bring any prawn upgrades, my bad. Alright, what kind of things can we make? So we already have module 1, but we could have made that. Got the engine efficient. Cyclops shield generator. Creates a temporary barrier around the sub, rendering it invulnerable for brief time. Uh, sonar upgrade. Okay, we know about that. Oh, no. Scans the terrain outside. The Displays it on the 3D map. Ooh, that's kind of cool. So a fire suppression system. Going to definitely need that. Solves the fire suppression system on the Cyclops, just in case. Cyclops decoy tube upgrade increases the capacity. Okay, converts environmental heat into electrical power for use by the Cyclops. Nice. All right, so we got some cool upgrades that we can do. Um, but I really want to just start customizing this ship. Like that's what I want to do. So we're gonna come in here. We're gonna get out our good old housing crafting gun, and we're gonna start placing things that we want. So we want to get some some uh, some plants. I think this one, the schick looking pot, is good. Can we put it in here at all? No, it doesn't look like we can. Can we put it in our main area? It looks like we can, in fact, do that. So what we're gonna do is we want to get as close to this corner as we can. There we go. And then we're gonna do another one over here. We go so then we can get some bulba trees in here um gonna be very crucial to our survival because we survive solely off bulba um which means we have just oh indigestion all day long uh, we want a radio in here so we're gonna get a radio and we're gonna get this puppy slap well actually we should probably have that in here it makes more sense to have it in here oh shut up speaking of bulba good lord um, we'll go ahead and slap this guy. Is it going to fit on there? No, it's just going to hover if we put it right there. Um, let's put it... We don't want it right there because it's right behind the thing. Dang it. Um, it's going to be behind all the bulba. Nah, let's just put it in here. Whatever. We'll put... We'll put it like right up here. Why you no do this? Huh? Titanium and copper. Alright, so now we want a fabricator. We're going to take a fabricator. Can we slap it right underneath? We can. Look at that. Right there. And then what we need now is we need power cell chargers. Um, we'll have all this stuff placed so then we can kind of go around as we pick stuff up. We want, let's see, we've got one over here, so we want to get one guy right up here. And then do we have more batteries on the side over here? We do, so we want another one. Basically, we want it here, dang it. So then we can always pop these batteries out and slap them into here. Um, we should probably actually make, can I get more Wait a minute. Oh, man. This is where we should have all the freaking trees. Just need titanium for this. We'll get some trees in here, and we'll go and get rid of these trees over here. We're just kind of setting everything up right now. That's what we're doing. We're, we're getting an idea of the structure we want. Oh my god, she's gonna complain. Let me just drink some... Oh, I don't have any water. Well, well that's a bummer right now, isn't it? Should take me right to the door, right? Yeah, good. Let's go down and we'll get a couple... Uh, we'll get titanium and some bulba seeds. We'll just start with two, and then as they grow, we'll grab um, we'll grab the other ones. Phew. You're about to complain. Vital 
vital signs stabilizing. Survive on a diet of pure bulba. I basically am one of these trees by now. Okay, so what we need is a lot of titanium. And I have a little bit, so I have enough to make a couple things. Let's grab some copper. Let's grab some, I think we need ruby, right? Ruby. Um, what was it that, I think it was aerogel and crystalline. We'll have to do that at some other point. Um, let's see. What was it to build this? Advanced wiring kit. Bomb, bomb, bomb. I don't think we have any more of those, actually. I think I used that one up that I had. Yep. That's a bummer. Oh, well. So. Uh, advanced wiring kit. What, is it, what does it take to make that? Silver, gold, and a computer chip. Computer chip, table coral. So it takes a lot to make these. So it's going to take a little effort to get those guys made. Um, I really want that shield generator upgrade pretty much as soon as we possibly can. Oh, we got the nice bed now. Fantastical. Um, so we want that shield generator. Uh, what I was wanting to look at is this. Vehicle upgrades. We want the cyclops. Cyclops upgrades. Here we go. Thermal, no. Fire suppressors, that's one that we're going to probably want. Shield generator. Of course! You suck. Whatever. Let's get over here and do the basic stuff. Do I have any on me? No, I don't. Alright, let's go. We'll start with these two. Yeah, I, you know, someone on, on YouTube gave me, uh, they left a comment. Gave me a tip that we can pretty much build whatever we want in the Cyclops. So I really wanted to build some stuff and just kind of start really making it our own. Um, I wanted to do that before we stopped today. I know we won't get super far into building, but at least we can put some effort into it. Alright, build it up. Bingo. And switch. There you go. We'll build this guy. Boom. Switch. There. Now we can start getting bulba trees in here. Can we get the fabricator in here? What does it take? I did not grab any gold or a table coral. But I can build the radio. At least that much. Shabam. Beautiful. Um, yeah, it's going to be a lot of going back and forth for upgrading this guy. So, I think we'll get the fabricator... And we'll think about some more things to put on this. And then we'll uh, probably call it quits. This has been fantastic. It really has. It's been really, really good. We've, um... So I need table coral. I don't think I have any table coral in here, but I need gold. I know I have gold in here. Lots of gold. So let's go down and get some table coral. I think it was two. Yeah. Hit me in the face. Come here. Got it. Gotta start working on upgrades to our magnificent beast. I want a sticker on here that is just a picture of the ghost levi we can make a picture frame and hang it <gasps> we can hang a picture of the, the dead fred oh my god why did i run all the way over here oh my god we can hang a picture of dead fred um that's like all i care about now copper wire oh dude i can make that Bingo. I don't think I can make it right now. Oh, I can. Do it up. Perfect. I want that front and center. Oh my god. Can I put it right over top? Please let me do this.
It's either this one or it's this one. I think this is like the best one. That's a pretty good one. See, that's a good one, but I like, I like, where is it? Where'd it go? I like this one. Right? What happens when I shut the door? Look at that. I just don't like where it is. I hate to say. So we're going to go hang it up somewhere else. But I, I want it in here somewhere really bad. Let's, let's just make this like our picture wall right here. We could do that. Come on, there's like perfect space. What are you talking about? There we go. Now we can always remember the day we killed Fred. Fantastic. Well, guys. Let's go ahead and let's let's do... No, I'm not ready to be done. We can make a bed in here. Cool. I don't want, like, a huge bed, though. I would only want, like, one of the single beds like this. Like this and kind of get it, like... Huh. It had, like... It was alright for a minute there and then it just stopped. I'm here. There we go. Do I have fiber mesh on me? Oh no, he's using titanium. Get a bed in here, so then if it's dark out, we can go ahead and just sleep. I've started to build it. We'll get fiber mesh later. What else? What other things can we build? I'm just, man, I'm so, I'm so happy about putting that picture up of Fred. <laughs> it's so good. I love it. Ah, I love this game. I really do. Put a coffee machine right below Fred. The dead the picture of dead Fred. We can always move it. So let's go ahead and let's slap on there. Can oh I can I build it? Oh no I'm out of titanium now. But now we can have a cup of coffee and we can while we wait for it we can enjoy this picture of Fred dead. <laughs> I'm so happy about it. We killed him Oh, it's so good. All right. What other things? I don't really care about garbage cans and benches and stuff like that. Um, aquarium? Could we get an aquarium in here? We could. We could get our own. I mean, we have, like, fish right outside the window, so that's kind of dumb, actually. Uh, modification station, though. Definitely a necessity. Okay. Um, we got these. We need a battery charger. Trying to really hook this place up. Really hook it up. Bingo. Battery charger. Could probably use some lockers. That's for sure. Well, what's, what about the big ones, huh? How big is the big one? Nice, actually. That should be pretty good. Can I get one more? Oh, I can't get any more because it's like right up against it. Um, modification station. Let's move you like this. Okay, we should be able to get another locker in here now. Okay. So, uh, uh, med, med bay fabric fabricator or whatever. Let's get another one of these over here. Wow, that takes a lot to make that, huh? Huh, I'm slightly moving. That's weird. I kind of wonder what kind of things would come and try and mess with this. I don't know. Alright, what other things 
can we or should we build? We've got fabricator. Got this. Got this. Don't need wall lockers because we have the big lockers that we can throw stuff into. Uh, plant shelf. Meh. Don't need it. Beds, signs, counters, blah, blah, blah. This is all kind of bland stuff like we don't really need. Um, I don't think I can really build any of this because it's all like necessitates a base, uh, essentially. Um, and then this is like power stuff. Can you get a floodlight in here? I don't really want one. I'm just curious if you can. No, you can't. Okay. Uh, what about this guy? Nope. These are not the kind of things you build in here. How about a glass wall? That's it. I think that's about all we're going to build in here, guys, honestly. We want one little recharge station so we can always have batteries. Places to store our stuff. Um, health pack. We've got our fabricator. We've got a bed so we can sleep when it gets dark out. I mean, this is about the gist of all I really want in this base. Now we just have to collect all the stuff that we need. Which I think what we'll do is... um. Because because we're, we're basically done for the day, guys. This is where we're going to stop. It's a very triumphant moment. It's very good. This is a very good moment. Um, what we'll do is I will write down everything that we need for all of these things. And then uh, we'll go out and next time we will go and get them. And then we will build our Cyclops base. And then maybe we'll start cruising around trying to find some stuff. I don't know. Like, I'm really nervous about using this. Um... Because I don't want something to happen and then it's just destroyed. Um, but we could cruise around. We could drop the prawn down. and You know, there's a lot of stuff that we can do. Um, how's our power doing? Isn't there a way to look at it from right here? Isn't there a window or something? What's on the other side? Yeah, we got to get, like, we have a lot of stuff to build for this. Our power is, our energy is still really good, though. I mean, we're still, like, way up there. So each one of these provides 200 apiece, so cool but with that being said guys that is where we're gonna stop for today for subnautica uh, we did it we set a goal and we achieved it fred is dead we have killed fred um the problem is we did in in killing fred we also learned there's more than one fred and um we're probably gonna have to face off with fred 2 electric boogaloo um at some point so what happens if we do this whoa okay that's pretty neat doesn't really change much but it's cool it's cool anyways with that being said guys thank you for joining me for on this excursion in subnautica once again thank you for this celebratory moment that we can now share forever i mean it's immortalized in this beautiful picture like, I, I, I'm probably going to post this on my Twitter. Like, I'm so proud of this. I can't even begin to tell you. Like, I will never not be happy about what we've done here today. Fred got dead. Great job. Anyways, thank you for joining me, guys. If you would like to watch back on any of Subnautica, you can do so on YouTube.com slash MrBagels. You can also watch it live at Twitch.tv slash MrBagels. And if you're on Twitch, you can just scroll down. You can find all the links there. If uh, you're on YouTube, you can also go into the description. You'll find the links there. Or go to the About Me page and whatnot. But either way, thanks for joining me, guys. And I hope you will join me next time. I am Mr. Bagels. Goodbye. <laughs>